Greetings comrades, hope this finds you well. Quick shout out to INN, which I'm stoked to be a founding member of. So I saw this story as I was scrolling through the Twitter feed earlier about how supervisors at this candle factory in Kentucky were threatening to fire workers because the workers wanted to leave because a tornado was coming. Again, this is just another disgusting example of how this capitalist system that we live in puts profits, in this case, this goddamn fucking candle factory, they gotta get out there, you know, gotta make sure we get the fucking candles out there, fuck it, you get murdered by this tornado, this this tornado murks you, fuck it, man, we gotta, we gotta pump out as many candles as we can to keep our, you know, corporate shareholders, we gotta keep the CEO, you know, uh, they gotta have their yacht, their private jet, so some of you, you know, poor working class people die to, you know, keep those profit margins as high as possible. So be it. So be it. Again, that's, that's quintessential capitalism. It puts profits above people's lives. That's like why you have a for-profit fucking healthcare system. That's why you have, uh, you know, just, just everything, whether it's, you know, housing, education, employment, capitalism is an inherently a rational system because it's not designed to meet the needs of the people. It's designed to maximize profits to make the capitalist class, the owner class, the billionaire class as rich as possible. Consequences be damned. And this, these supervisors at this fucking candle factory in Kentucky threatening to fire people if they left to seek shelter during a goddamn fucking tornado warning is just another disgusting example of that. Again, capitalism is the real virus here. We need, you know, a economy, a society, a socialist or communist society that actually puts the needs of the people, the needs of the masses, the needs of the working class before profits. We need a rationally planned, centrally planned economy designed to meet the needs of the people so we don't have supervisors threatening to fire workers during a fucking tornado warning, during a goddamn tornado fucking storm that killed, I think, several dozen people in Kentucky so they can die at the altar of capitalism to get some more fucking candles pumped out of this goddamn candle factory. <sighs> Jesus fucking Christ, man. I mean, it's egregious, but this type of shit isn't surprising, right? You see it time and time again like we can't get fucking health care during a goddamn pandemic while nearly 70,000 people die each year in the United States because they lack health care we have 500,000 plus people homeless even though we have tens of millions of homes sitting uninhabited because again capitalism it's not a rational system it's not designed to meet the material conditions of people it's designed to maximize profit and a very small you know capitalist class does very well while other people are told to fucking risk their lives to make goddamn candles during a goddamn fucking tornado warning in in fucking kentucky in this kentucky candle factory disgusting but not surprising this is capitalism this is capitalism and i think more and more people are understanding this is a system that needs to be thrown on the goddamn scrap heap because it does nothing but enrich the capitalist class while the masses struggle mightily and live in very, very precarious conditions, right? Like the video if you like the damn video. Subscribe for more content. All part of the people. Quick shout out to two Uber comrades supporting my channel, my partner in Indie Left News. Definitely check out Indie Left News. Peace. Much love.